Hey, it's Min from The Art of Verbal War, where people learn to excel in verbal skills. Today's video is called, How to Talk Like Frank Underwood. Yup, the main character of House of Cards, and a character that's probably the most Machiavellian character on TV shows these days. So today I'm not gonna teach you how to be Machiavellian, maybe another day, but in this video, I'm going to teach you two specific verbal skills that Frank Underwood is a master at, which are, number one, how to deal with threats. And number two, I'm gonna teach you his number one persuasion technique. So let's start with number one, how to deal with threats. Frank lives in a world of power games, so he's always in a position of either making threats or dealing with threats. We're going to talk about dealing with threats today. So here are some examples of Frank dealing with threats. In this first scene, he's dealing with a powerful person's assistant. And this assistant is having a power trip, so Frank replies, proximity to power deludes some into thinking they wield it. In this next scene, Frank is dealing with a union representative. In response to the union rep's threat, he says, the most you'll ever make of yourself is blowing men like me. And in this last scene, when threatened by Raymond Tusk, the powerful businessman, Frank says, you may have all the money, Raymond, but I have all the men with guns. In order to deal with threats, you have to be what I call a master in frame control. Did you see my Jessica Pearson video on frame control? Check that out if you haven't in order to learn more about frame control. But basically in that video I taught you that frame control is all about finding the winning frame. Even when your opponent has come at you with a strong attack, what you end up actually saying will flow naturally from the winning frame you adopt. So in the first thing, in the first so in the first scene, Frank's frame is that the other person is actually delusional. In the second scene, frame adopts the I'm the one with real power frame. In the last scene with Raymond Tusk, Frank's frame is, I actually have power, you just have money. Okay, now I'm gonna teach you Frank Underwood's number one persuasion technique. This technique is his main technique for persuading people of his views. And what is this technique? It's his amazing use of metaphors. Now metaphors are like a shortcut to persuasion. Have you ever heard the saying, show, not tell? You can tell people what you're trying to persuade them of, but ultimately it's not very effective. But metaphors allow you to show, not just tell. So Frank Underwood in particular, he loves to use a specific kind of metaphor. So here are a few of those specific metaphors. Number one, for those of us climbing to the top of the food chain, there can be no mercy. There is but one rule, hunt or be hunted. Number two, I love that woman. I love her more than sharks love blood. Number three, a cat likes to play with the mouse before the killing blow. What do these all have in common? Yup, they're animal kingdom metaphors. Animal kingdom metaphors are extremely powerful because almost every human being understands them intuitively. They talk to our very nature as human beings, as complex animals, and as animals that play power games. Now, animal kingdom metaphors are not the only kind of metaphors there are, so if you want to learn more about how to use metaphors masterfully like Frank Underwood, you might be interested in my mini course Master of Metaphor, a course that will teach you the many different ways to use metaphors in a powerful way so that people will start seeing you as a verbal god. For a free preview of Master of Metaphor and to get on the list for the course, go to www.artofverbalwar.com forward slash metaphor. This course won't be made available publicly and will only be available to people on this email list. So I hope you sign up. That's it for today. Hope I've taught you how to channel your inner Frank Underwood. Till next time, I'm Min Liu with The Art of Verbal War. Please subscribe to this YouTube channel.